The Bible says, I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. We know to thank God for the gifts. We know to thank God for the blessings. But it's a challenge to consider the psalmist's words here to say, I will bless the Lord at all times. Do you thank the Lord in everything? Because the Bible commands us in everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. If you're going to bless the Lord at all times, you're going to have to make, have to make a decision, like the psalmist did, to bless the Lord at all times. You see, he decided before the battle, before the struggle, before the afflictions that he talks about later in this chapter, that he would bless the Lord at all times. He said, I will. He decided. He made up his mind. He resolved. And if you're going to be thankful and give thanks in everything, maybe not for everything, but in everything, you're going to have to make up your mind that God is always right, even when you don't understand and that all things really do work together for good, even if all things aren't good on their surface. Even the difficult things, even the trying things, even the seemingly discouraging things are things to thank God for because all those things work together for good. But you and I have to make up our minds that his praise shall continually be in my mouth that you will thank God for the mountaintops, you will thank God for the valleys, because as long as you are following him and his lead, you're right where God wants you to be, and you're becoming all God wants you to be. And if you want the Lord to show up in your life today, praise him, because he inhabits the praises of his people. But it's up to you to decide if you will bless the Lord.